All right, good morning. So we are back with some more tips on what to do if you get injured right now as we're all on lockdown. So um, we covered the hand last, we covered the nerves, and I eventually wanna get back and cover a vascular issue at the hand, but why don't we move up to the elbow? So the two most common elbow issues that I see in the office, one is what's called tennis elbow. And if you, if you turn the hand out like this, on this side, if the elbow's aggravated out there, that's what's commonly known as tennis elbow. If we're aggravated over here on this side, that's what's called golfer's elbow. So for tennis elbow, if we look at the anatomy, this is the back of a right forearm right here. Here's the thumb and the fingers. And all the muscles that pull the fingers and the wrist up, they all come and attach out here at the outside part of the elbow. So if you, if you look at me, right here as we come up, they're all gonna attach right here. So when those muscles get aggravated, what happens is they get overloaded and they start to adhere to one another. So what we have to do is we have to break those down so that then they don't put so much pressure on the, on the tendon. So the way that we do that is if you come up here right off of the edge of the bone and just do what's called a cross friction. So what I'm doing is I'm taking my thumb and I'm going side to side. So the tendon's running this way and I'm going horizontally over that tendon just to try to break that up. And then if we take a lacrosse ball and we pin it down in all that tissue on the back of the forearm and we start with the elbow locked out, the wrist extended, and then we apply pressure and just flex the wrist and the fingers over and over again, what we'll do is we'll break all that tissue up and help to relieve the stress out there. So with this one, it's the same thing if you attempt an exercise two to three times and you have to shut it down, that's typically when you need to seek additional care. Also, if you've done this for about a week or two and you're not getting anywhere with it, same thing, that's when it's time to, to reach out to someone and look to uh, get some help with it. So anyway, we are open, we're here to help. So let me know if you have any questions and take care. Thanks.